this kind of monotone style with this atypical syllable delivery and you know that wins you a lot of points from people who like original and creative music so for me that's awesome the challenge with this kind of monotone style and atypical syllable delivery however is to think about when creating contrast and energy and then delivery and switching it up a bit throughout the course of the song and the song structure might make sense. Okay, that's that's the challenge for anyone who has a style similar to that. And I would say oftentimes this is feedback I have to think about for myself because I can often have too much of a monotone style sometimes, especially when you listen to an entire project. So there are, to be fair, plenty of monotone artists that succeed without changing their style for sure, but it can be harder than you might imagine. Think about how much you might enjoy Earl Sweatshirt and how much certain verses and features and tracks are so fucking good, but then think to yourself, how long, how many times have I ran through a whole project from him back to front, right? Interesting, across his whole career too, right? So that comparison comes to mind a bit if we're talking about leveling up. Uh, but, you know, I would say also another thing to point out is many successful monotone artists end up realizing this and they come up with a different energy just for the hook so it doesn't have to be something you change in your verse or uh, a good contrasting feature can really help break things up a bit and make it very refreshing when your style comes back. That can really help with listener engagement uh, especially for a whole project's worth of listening. You know, it never hurts to be more open to selecting different kinds of beats that, you know, when if you're getting to the point where you're trying, wanting to try something different, I don't think you have to jump into that right now. Uh, I've found personally that picking beats uh, that have a very different energy from your average kind of beat that you feel like is your strong suit can be worth playing with. You don't have to release it if you don't like it. Um, it can be a subtle way to break you out of some of your patterns of delivery that you naturally gravitate towards. Again, I'm just trying to give you an idea. I think everything you've done is great. Nothing needs to be changed. I'm heavily fucking with this song. I'm just trying to point out things that I've learned, you know, just in case, you know. Uh, so collaborating with other artists might really help with this kind of growth. Uh, 